It is our privilege to have again here at our Leadership Vistas International Dinner a guest that uh, literally is world renowned. He is a classical and sacred trained pianist. He has played in Hong Kong. He has played in Copenhagen, Berlin, London, Vienna, Brussels, Tokyo. And I know two Christmases ago at First Baptist Church in Frisco, Texas. He, uh, he is, uh, has been for many years, blessed our hearts uh, as he was for four decades, half of the acclaimed piano duo of Nielsen and Young, who literally traveled throughout the world, blessed our hearts with classical and sacred music. He and his wife, Caroline, they reside here in Dallas. They played for us so many times. He has a daughter, Christiana, who is a managing editor of D Magazine. And I just renewed my subscription to D Magazine. <laughs> just renewed my, pres my, my pres subscription for that. And then they also, and we had the privilege of hearing her as well at First Baptist Church in Frisco, Caroline, their daughter, who is a voice professor in, in Rochester. She is a graduate of the Eastman School, uh, and, uh, but just found out that she is going to begin her doctorate this summer. The only one of 176 that applied, the only vocal student. Isn't that great? Isn't that wonderful? The, the acorn doesn't fall, or should I say because it's a lady, the apple doesn't fall too far from the tree. Again, we are glad to have back with us, let's welcome Stephen Nielsen. Thank you so much. And of course, it is once again a delight for me to be here with you in this festive occasion <clears throat> uh, for which my wife and I have such an affection for what you're doing and the vision and the impetus that you have in, in this day and age. And we are we're so grateful to be here. First of all, uh, kind of a shortened version. Uh, Steve said one piece. I've been given 10 minutes, so uh, anyway, it's going to be a, a little mishmash. But uh, first of all, a shortened version of an impromptu in E flat major by the great Franz Schubert.
Uh, some weeks ago when I was thinking about being here again at uh, Andy's largesse and, and uh, what a privilege it is, I was thinking what I of all I have known about leadership vistas and then, uh, you know, in one of those sleepless nights, the marvelous uh, hymn, uh, O Love of God, How Strong and True, came to mind. That is sung to the tune Jerusalem. Many of you will remember that marvelous hymn in the church service in the movie Chariots of Fire. Do you remember that? It was so, so uh, beautiful. And I thought um, of the mission of uh, Leadership Vistas and how you're energizing and invigorating, invigorating uh, marvelous pastors to uh, serve on what a mission field, volatile continent of Africa, but what a mission. And I thought of Eric Little's iconic words in Chariots of Fire, when I run, I feel his presence. And surely when you run with this organization, you feel his presence. Uh, one stanza of O Love of God, How Strong and True, says, O love of God, our shield and stay through all the perils of our way. Eternal love in you we rest, forever safe, forever blessed. We will exalt you, God and King, and we will ever praise your name. We will extol you every day and evermore your praise proclaim. And that's what this organization is about. So I've arranged for the first time uh, a short version of that beautiful hymn tune to which are commonly sung those words. And to close my arrangement of a beautiful hymn of dedication that I assume all of you can sing heartily and with sincerity, take my life and let it be consecrated, Lord, to thee. 